Honorable guest, ladies and gentlemen, I would like to start thanking to our special guests that are today with us for uh, their uh, help and for their support to build the first European Public Prosecutor Office. They represent the European Parliament, the Council, the European Commission and the host uh, state. Ladies and gentlemen, this is a historic moment. Today, the European Public Prosecutor Office is taking up its duties. We are no longer dreaming about the future, we are making it happen. After more than two decades of legal discussions, followed by difficult political negotiations, we took less than two years for practical preparation. This is it. So, today, it's not about an extraordinary legal text. It is about those who have to make it work. We have an enormous responsibility. There is no precedent for a European Public Prosecutor Office. Our decisions will directly affect the fundamental rights of European citizens. We are the first really sharp tool to defend the rule of law in the EU. Our success is a matter of credibility for our Union. We have a complex structure, a central level with 15 permanent chambers in which different combination of 22 European prosecutors and myself will take key decisions in thousands of cases each year. We have decentralized offices for altogether 140 European delegated prosecutors using different equipment, technologies, methods and languages. We are a single office operating under 22 different criminal procedural regimes. This has never been attempted before. Our target, economic and financial criminality. Make no mistake, this is the most common threat to any democratic society. It is underreported, underestimated, often even tolerated to the benefit of organized criminal organizations that aspire to subvert and replace legitimate authorities. Ultimately, this is whom we are going to be dealing with. People who do not shy away from extreme violence to secure their impunity. This is why the independence of the EPPO is vital. Only an independent judiciary can enforce the law equally for everybody. We have a unique competence, we have great powers, we have so much potential. With EPPO, our union can enforce one of its fundamental principles. By protecting the European Union's budget, we will play an essential role in making the European citizens trust in the union stronger than ever. Ladies and gentlemen, we are ready to start. One thing is sure. This would not have been possible without the incredible enthusiasm, dedication and professionalism of the EPPO team. Thanks to them, as from today, there is a simple address where to report suspicious of fraud for the EU budget, the EPPO. Thank you very much for your attention. I will be happy to answer to your question after the speeches of distinguished guests. Mission